Hi there. In this video, I'm going to show you how to integrate payment systems in Cloud Funnels. So we're going to start with the funnel. Click on Funnels Insights, and you can see your funnels here. And I'm going to go with the funnel that I've created. This is the sales page. I can click Edit. Now, of course, this is professional page. This is testing, so uh, don't expect properly written copy and graphics over here. But it's going to be enough to uh, show you how to integrate your payment integrations. So we've got an opt-in here. We've got a sales page here. This is the sales page. And I can edit the sales page if I want to. I can change any aspect of it. Click and this is something nice. Whatever you want to type, you can do so. So it's easy to change anything. Click on Save Template, and it will be updated on the main site too. All right, so uh, next thing that you have here is the question, how are you going to integrate the payment system? So I'm going to show you exactly that. Go into payment methods and click on create new. Here I've got one. Click on create new. And we have native integrations for PayPal, Stripe, Authorize.net, JVZoo, Varier Plus, Pay.com, PayKickstart, Thrivecard and ClickBank and more are coming. So this effectively actually covers the entire market pretty effectively. It covers most of the popular IM or you know online payment systems. And if there is something that you would like us to integrate, you are always welcome to come and tell us. And based on you know case specific situation, we can probably do that for you. All right. So coming to this, I'm going to show you how to integrate with JVZoo and the and the system is pretty much same across the board. Of course, there will be little differences based on what payment system you're using, but the system would be pretty, pretty much similar. And if you're familiar with the payment system in question, you will be able to integrate it without any hassles. So for example, to integrate JVZoo, just on it, and you'll be asked to give this payment method a title. So you can call it my JVZoo payment. And you will need to give it a secret key. So uh, we use JVZoo IPN and with IPN, with nearly every implementation of IPN, whether it's PayPal, whether it's JVZoo, you can pass a secret key which you can verify inside of your own, you know, uh, systems that it is the request is indeed coming from you. So put in your random sequence, anything that you want. This is your secret, and you need not tell anyone else about it. Don't make make sure you never tell anybody else a secret key. But this is something that you decide. Click on save, and that's it. The payment system is integrated, and if I Go into my payment methods. I can see my JVZoo payment here. From there on, to put this on my website, it's very easy. I've got my funnel here. Click on Edit Funnel. The first thing, I'm going to show you how to put a JVZoo Buy button on my sales page. So I've got a sales page here. I'm going to go back to editing it, and here it is. So I've got a Buy button which is neutral. It's not a JVZoo Buy button, and I want to replace it with a JVZoo Buy button. So I'm just going to delete it. It's deleted already. And then I'm going to go inside of JVZoo. This is JVZoo. And JVZoo gives you a buy button code. So does so do many other platforms. Even PayPal can give you a buy button code. And you can use that instead if you want to. So whatever you want, you can take the buy button code, wherever button you like, and come back. And here, you will now need to go to the component block system, open blocks. Scroll down a little bit. And what we have here, is the JVZoo custom code. You can see that this is an HTML code and you need to integrate it in HTML. So just go into Cloud Funnels blocks and find custom code, then drag and drop it in the location where you want the buy button integrated. You'll get a little pop-up which will ask you to insert your code, paste your buy button code over here, click on save, and that's all you need to do to integrate your buy button. You can see it right over here. Now save the template and your buy button is saved. That's all you need to do on the sales page to integrate your JVZoo buy button, for instance. Now, we also want to make sure that we are notified by IPN about any orders that we get through JVZoo, and we should be able to process these orders. So to do that, we have to set up the order form. Now, I do know, and you, of course, realize that when we order through JVZoo, they have their own uh, payment system. They have their own payment form on jvzoo.com, so we won't be using our order form. That's absolutely correct, but click on order form, and you don't need to set it up at all. You can even just, you know, uh, click on edit existing page and leave it empty. Like right now, I have a totally empty page. It doesn't matter. 
what I need to do to integrate my payment is click on settings right over here and you will see an option that says select payment method. So we need to have a valid order form, but we don't need to put anything there. It will never be shown to customers, but any order that we get from JVZU will be inside that order form. So click on my JVZU IPN and this is the URL for your order form. Select the IPN that you want to work with. I've got two JVZU IPN and my JVZU IPN that I just set up. I will just take the URL right over here click on save settings and now inside of my JVZU I have to put this in the product uh, I have to put this in the product in the IPN field I will show you that too so here I am in my JVZU product editing page I'm editing a product and if you scroll on enough you will find this little field here JVZ pin IPN URL just paste the URL that you got from inside of cloud funnels right over here into this field and click save my product now JVZU will start sending IPN requests to uh, Cloud Funnels, your integration of Cloud Funnels, and you will be able to get automatic, you know, you will be able to create the accounts for your customers automatically. People will have the access to membership. They will be added to leads, and all of that will be done from inside of Cloud Funnels without any further action. Just click on Save Settings. So now when I go to the sales page. This is the sales page over here. I can see that it got the JVZU button, and when people click on it, I will be taken to jvzu.com to make the payment. And once the payment is made, the entry will be made in my IPN and I will be able to get the details of the member. Now I'm going to go back to that page, going to show you a couple more features. Here's the settings button for the sales page. And you can always see which page is selected by the little blinking icon over here. So if, it, if you're on the opt-in page, you can see the blinkers on the opt-in. When you're sales page, you will see the blinker on the sales page. And when you're in the other form, you will see the blinking icon on the other form. So when I'm on the sales page, I can see the blinking icon there. And coming back to the other form, I'm going to click on settings again. And I want to show you some of the advanced features. So not only you can select the payment method, you can put in the payment integration that you want, but you can also connect this to the list. So if you got a list on your in your cloud funnels, you can set up a list over here you can automatically add anyone who purchases the product to that list. And if you got a membership, so you can create a membership from here, you can automatically authorize that person to that membership using the same integration. And if you've got an autoresponder, you can set up the autoresponders from here. You can automatically add that person to your autoresponder. And if you got any other kind of integration, you can select that integration too, like Zapier or anything. All of that is possible. And you can connect this to a product too. So if you want sales analysis and you suppose you're, you know, you got some products integrated, you can just click on the product and all the payments that are, you know, coming through for that particular product, they will be, you know, using the IPN and you will get a sale inside the product too. So you will get everything inside of Cloud Funnels fed through that IPN. So it's that simple to use jvzu with cloud funnels and not only jvzu we got a bunch of payment systems again back here you've got all the leading payment systems in the market paypal stripe and many more and we are adding to it continuously so there will be more here too and if you're using something again if you're using something that's not here tell us about it we might just make it